Right. Oh, forgot that was there. <laughs> right, guys. So today we're going to be checking out something a bit more serious, much, much more serious. Um, you know, you know, to people that have to deal with racism every day, just because of the colour of their skin, of their skin. Um, because of their culture or whatever, you know, in today's society, it should not be tolerated. It is absolutely unacceptable to behave in, in such a, uh, you know, in, in a manner. It's, it's not acceptable. You know, you think in today's age, racism would be you know, a thing of the past, but unfortunately, racism these days is alive and well. So. Unfortunately, we've got a perfect example of why racism is still alive and well today. So we've got a video here called Racist Man Being Kicked Off uh, off the Train. Uh, what can I say? It's obviously a video of, an abs of a guy being an absolute cock, basically. And uh, let's just hope that uh, he gets his ass whooped, hopefully. So I'm going to check it out. Go. New York, USA. I And what's that supposed to mean? I didn't do anything to you. What did you do? What do you mean you didn't do nothing? Whoa. That guy in the red hat, he wants a piece of his ass. Is he drunk or what? I don't know if that's a beer in his hand or not. Who cares? I don't know why this guy cares so much that he's a lawyer. He went to. Well, you go. Know, Academy, college, wherever you want to go to be a lawyer, who cares? Just because you're a lawyer, what, that makes you above everyone else? What a dick! He wants people to beat him up. Small mindedness, what are you doing then? You're not thinking, mate. Give me my back. Give me my back. What are you doing? Of course, it's taking my back. That's my property. Stop trying to block my property. What are you doing? Fuck your back, dude. Yeah, pretty much. Well, you can't stand on a train and, and scream racist stuff. <laughs> he fell over. He got shoved over. Oh! Oh! This guy's absolutely. He's got to be drunk. All he cares about is his property now. Get off the train! Get off the train! Get off the train! Get off the train right now! Don't let him back on. Oh! Fine standard broke a bottle over his head. And there you go again. An officer was on site. No record of him being arrested though. I don't know what this guy's problem was. Seriously, what was this guy's problem? What what makes a person act like that? What makes a person get on a train and start screaming stuff like that? Acting absolutely like he was acting like a child. Absolutely acting like a child. I mean, I've seen I've seen children 20 years younger than this guy. I don't know how old this guy is, but 20 years, 25 years. He looks, he looks like he's in his mid-30s, maybe 
late 30s. I don't know, quite, I don't, can't see quite, can't tell quite sure quite, what, how old he is. But there are children out there who act more mature. You know, it's, it's not acceptable. It's absolutely unacceptable. You know, the, the people on there had absolutely every right to kick him off the train. I wouldn't want him on the train. Nobody wanted him on the train. So, I'm surprised he didn't get his ass beat. I mean, he's lucky to have gotten away with having... He was lucky to get away with being shoved to the ground and getting a few little kicks and getting some juice or whatever thrown over him, but it makes me feel embarrassed, right? For, you know, for, for other white people. Yeah, because not all white people are racist. They're not. You know, but it's people like this that make the rest of us look really bad. And unfortunately, there's a lot of people out there who judge an entire people by one individual. And I'm not, I'm not just talking about racists. I'm talking about anything, really. You know, one person from one race does something, caught on videos, put on the internet, whatever. You get stupid individuals like this. We do things like this and it makes the rest of us look bad and and this is why the cycle of racism just continues. It's a never ending cycle of racism. It's it's never gonna stop. It is never gonna unfortunately guys, racism is alive and well and it's it's never gonna go away. You could be broadcast across the entire world, your face on every screen, your voice being heard on every radio station, uh, being broadcasted in every single different language, and, and I, I could give, I'm not saying I can, but let's just say that I gave the greatest speech on why it's no good being racist, racism should stop. I could give the greatest, most convincing speech Ever. why racism should stop I'm not saying I can I'm saying it if I could right there'll still be racists out there I don't know what else to say on the matter I really don't being being a ra if you're a racist if you are a racist I implore you please change your ways change your ways or at least keep all that Crap to yourself. What, what, what good is it being a racist? What, what, what good comes from being a racist? Nothing but trouble. Nothing but negativity and it can cause a lot of trouble. So I don't see the benefit of being a racist. Why would you want to be a racist? Absolutely unacceptable. Thing is, the guy was. It looked like the guy. It looked like the guy was drunk. It looked like the guy was drunk or he was high on something. Whatever, it doesn't matter if you're intoxicated or you're, or you're high on something. It is absolutely unacceptable. Absolutely unacceptable. What a dick. Well look, if he really is a lawyer, then he shouldn't be one. Absolutely should not be one. Okay, if you've got that sort of mentality, then you should never be a lawyer, ever. I really hope this video has gone viral. I think it has gone viral. I think it has over four and a half million views on Facebook. And uh, it shouldn't be accepted. It's, it's not acceptable. I really hope this guy has lost his job or loses his job very, very soon. I mean, seriously, what what law company or whatever you know, lawyers go to, they'll see this footage and be like, right, this guy is never going to get a job here. This guy's never gonna get a job there. This guy is never gonna get a chance in the courtroom if he's like that. Absolutely unacceptable. So, you know, maybe this if this guy, you know, if this guy remembers what's happened, he's gonna look back on this video and I'm telling you, he's gonna regret it. He's gonna absolutely regret it. And this will probably, hopefully, this will be the last time ever he ever dares to speak out like this ever again. It's, I can't say it enough times. I've said unacceptable so many times in this video now. So, but yeah, it's not acceptable. So anyway, guys, thank you very much. And I'll see you guys later on the next video. Bye.